guys welcome back to my channel if you're new hi nice to meet you today i'm doing a really fun video i'm doing a fall fashion video i haven't video i haven't done one of these like a fashion video in so so long and you guys always are asking like what are you wearing so i was like okay let's do this video with like a little twist i'm going to be recreating some pinterest viral fall outfits so with things that are more accessible not like designer pieces or anything but accessible pieces that we can all shop for i'm going to try and link everything down below and if something is a little bit more expensive i'm going to try and link a dupe all that good stuff so keep watching you guys are excited i'm so excited to do this video i have, well, I have all the clothes laid out there and let's get started so i'm going to start with this one look that i've honestly been seeing everywhere i'm going to put it on the screen right here she's wearing a green sweater blazer tights looks like a white shirt under sunglasses black mini skirt you guys see but i actually had everything in my closet except for a green sweater so i found one on amazon and it's literally perfect i will link it obviously and it's a little bit darker than hers but i think it still does the trick we're gonna try it on and i'm gonna show you guys the whole look okay having this on i feel really like cool but I also think this is more winter just because I feel like I have so many layers on. And I think fall, for me at least, where I live, it's not as super cold yet. But also, I think you could get away with wearing this in fall with, like, no tights. So the sweater, like I said, is from Amazon. I'm wearing a white t-shirt under. This is from Brandy Melville. You can get a white t-shirt anywhere, but my favorite is from Brandy. And then this blazer is actually from Zara, but I just thrifted one that's like really oversized, which you can thrift black blazers anywhere and for like five bucks. My skirt is from Princess Polly. My tights are Sheer Tex. My boots are Sam Edelman. I really like it. I definitely feel cool. But like I said, I'm it's giving me more like Christmas vibes. I could definitely see myself wearing this. So if you see me wearing this, you know where it came from. Okay guys, this is the next look. This is what I recreated. So basically this girl is just super casual, wearing all white with like a little, like a nude sweater draped over her, a tote bag. Um, and she paired it with some nude shoes. These shoes look super cute. Um, I think they're Dior. Really cute, I obviously don't have them. So I just paired with some little slides. These are the slides I have. I got them off Etsy, they're like, dupes for the Yeezy slide. My top is from Urban. My jeans are from Princess Polly. My sweater is misguided. And I just kind of draped it over, make it really casual. I could see myself wearing this like to go grocery shopping almost. Like if it gets cold, you could just throw on the sweater. And I just love the look of just like draping your sweater over you. This is definitely going to be so big for in fall for sure. I've already seen so many people wearing it like this. I think it's cute. You could also like tie it if you wanted to to like keep it on your body and i think this is so cute it definitely elevates a simple outfit i definitely see this for fall especially where i live because it's just not super cold so this is a great outfit and you can just throw on a tote bag you can find tote bags anywhere so like amazon a little nude tote bag and you can literally recreate the whole look so i literally love this look this is one i'm recreating She's literally wearing such a traditional outfit, a collared white shirt, some, it looks almost like a black denim leather. It's, it could go either way. I chose leather and then just sandaled heels. So my half sandaled heels and then just black purse. This is so easy to recreate. Like even if you can recreate with black jeans, it's so traditional, so classic. I never thought to like pair this top with these pants and I've had the two for so long, so I'm definitely gonna wear it this season. She paired it with some gold jewelry. I didn't put on any jewelry right now, but I definitely would pair it with a few more necklaces just to make it a little more, a little more, you know what I mean? It feels so put together in this, and I literally just threw on like three pieces. My top is Brandy Melville, my bottoms are Aritzia, my sandals, my sandals are free people. I'll link everything obviously down below for you guys. But these pants are a little pricey. I think they're so worth it. Um, 
but I'll try and find a dupe for you guys because I know they definitely are some dupes. Okay, this is another little outfit I'm actually so in love with. So I could have paired this bodysuit, but I chose this one. This is from Zara. I actually ordered kind of a very almost identical tank top that she was wearing in the picture. I will link that one below. It just didn't come in time. So I went with this nude bodysuit, which I don't think I would pair with it when I get that tank top. I think I'll wear the tank top. I think it'll just match way better. The whole premise is just for a monochromatic nude look. So we have the bodysuit, we have the trousers, we have this white shirt that I need to steam, but I didn't get around to it. We have the nude purse. Any nude purse will work. This is the Prada one that I was gifted for Christmas last year. And then my shoes, she was wearing similar color shoes. So you could really just make it your own. You could pair with sneakers, whatever you feel guys. I think the bodysuit makes it a little more dressy, whereas like the tank top wouldn't. Love these trousers. These are Pepper Mayo, bodysuit Zara. This is Zara. As you can tell, I love Zara. <laughs> I actually really love this outfit. I think it's just, it makes all these outfits I feel so put together in. And I literally barely bought anything for this video. And that should just tell you that these are such timeless outfits and like such staple pieces put together. So it's so easy to recreate. I definitely want you guys to try and recreate these and tag me on Instagram if you post them. It's really making me see what I have in my closet, which I, that's why I love Pinterest. This outfit, you guys will see me in it. Don't you worry because these are just my favorite tones to wear, especially in fall. So I'm very happy. And I just love the way these shoes kind of like pop in the outfit. Super cute, super casual. And on to the next. This is the next outfit. I'm honestly not sure how I feel about it. So basically, as you can see in the picture, she's wearing a baseball cap, a brown blazer. It looks like she's wearing a little top, like a little black top, and she's wearing leather pants and boots. So I feel like this is good for like colder months, also windy months. I just don't like this hat on me for some reason. I think I like when hats cover my ears and this just like pokes them out. So I don't really like that. But I think this is like overall a pretty cute outfit. It seems a little more dressy. I know the hat is like trying to counteract the dressiness. I would probably pair this with the sneakers instead for like daytime, but I do like a brown and black moment for fall. So I definitely like that aspect of this outfit. I'm gonna probably wear this blazer a lot in fall. I don't know if I'm gonna exactly pair it like this. Like I said, I don't really like this hat. I definitely wanna get a different brown hat this season. I've been looking at some other ones to figure out like if I wanna get a plain one or if I wanna get a logo one. So I'll keep you guys updated on that. That's the video guys, I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed going through these outfits and kind of like figuring out new things I will wear for this season. Um, I feel like I need to do this more often because it really shows me like what I have in my closet is actually good and I can make so many outfits with these things that I have. Because sometimes I forget and I feel like sometimes I just wanna throw away my whole closet. But I Okay, to be fair, I've been collecting a lot more staple pieces in my wardrobe, which I have been trying to shop more of those type of clothes and not more of um, crazy prints and stuff like that. Trying to shop more timeless pieces. I, I should do another video about like a minimal wardrobe because to be honest, that's kind of what I've been gravitating more towards. And the most of these outfits, if you couldn't tell, were more of like that vibe. I think that's gonna be like big for fall. So yeah, that's the video guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Again, comment down below if you like these style of videos. I love you guys so, so much. I hope you have an amazing day, amazing week, amazing life, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.